Hey guys, what's up? Your boy Paul Picasso here. What's going on? So guys, I recently did a video uh, saying thank you to all of my subscribers, viewers, and so forth. That the channel is now at a uh, hundred plus. I think it's at 103 right now at the moment so you know again another thank you to that if you haven't seen that video there will be a link to that video in the description below go check it out leave a thumbs up I did something kind of different there um, basically just you know what I do so go ahead and check that out the hundred plus subscriber uh, special video go ahead and check that out in this video guys we're gonna be looking at a very cool app it is uh, basically it's called all-in-one gesture now I did see a, f uh, a video on this already and I decided it was pretty cool I had to check it out okay and now uh, so right off the bat um, let's get to all-in-one gestures here is all-in-one gestures right here okay so I have the exposed framework um, so I have the exposed framework via exposed installer uh, right there so I have that and usually when you download a a module for the exposed framework you know you get that little exclamation mark in the status bar that says a module has not been um, has not been activated yet something like that so when I downloaded the uh, the all-in-one gesture that came up so I'm like okay cool so now it gives it access to the exposed framework so I did that I restalled reinstall uh, blah, blah, blah. I restarted the device and then I noticed my nav my nav bar keys were gone and I'm like hmm why did it go um, I don't have uh, I don't have expanded desktop or anything on and um, I did not go into immersive mode so I was wondering like what is going on um, but I did manage to set up the gestures so basically swiping from the left right here that is back so I'll just go into something like that and that's back uh, recent is over here and yes I am on Slimcat the latest update of Slimcat I will do a review on this ROM really soon so keep a lookout for that and of course swiping from the bottom is uh, 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 go home and then I also did something where swiping from the top is actually the screenshots so that's pretty cool you can also have swiping from the top as uh, to turn off the screen there's a lot of stuff we're actually gonna show that so when that happened I realized I went back into the exposed framework and when I went into the exposed framework I uh, turned off I'm gonna go ahead and show you that right now there's a little lag just there go into exposed framework go into modules and there it is and I unchecked that and then my nav bar came back and I was like okay whew. I was wondering what was going on um, so that's pretty cool once you you know put it through the exposed install the exposed framework um, it automatically removes your nav bar buttons so that is pretty cool but before you do that you want to go ahead and just set up the all-in-one gestures so we're gonna go ahead and take a look in that application right now here we go and then it says uh, enable first of all you have hover you have swipe and status bar okay so first off the bat we have the edges where as I as you see here I checked top area to uh, screen capture left area is back and it does give you a little hint it shows you where it is right area is recent and bottom area is home apps now if we go up here into the settings um, basically I'll put some color on there so you guys can see and I'll leave it as red and there we go so now you can see the areas so once you swipe these areas those selected actions will happen so that's the areas guys and of course there are other areas where you can do some other stuff as well you have the upper left area which would be up here upper right area lower left area and lower right area and there are various things that you can do once you select it it brings up the entire list of what can be done so back recent menu power off screen off so I'm gonna go ahead and select uh, upper left so the upper left right there is now screen off so if I go like that and swipe from there there you see the screen has shut off so that is pretty cool as well 
um, that's basically that then you also have hover now hover as you see right here it says actions will be triggered when you move your stylus or mouse over the hotspot I assume this works for certain devices that have built-in um, styluses or gestures for that because I have tried it so see right here I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on and yes I am using my Nexus 4 so I turn it on and then I'm gonna hover you know over this part right here and nothing's happening nothing's happening uh, hover hover from the top obviously if I go like that and tap it it will do it but that's not really hovering so see I'll try to hover do, 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 nothing hovering isn't doing anything so it's not working on the Nexus 4 and I do have this app running through the exposed framework and then status bar uh, tap on the status bar to perform actions so you do have this option as well I always hide my status bar so I'm not going to you know I don't need to basically I'll just turn it on if you single tap on your status bar the screen will be off so I'll single tap, single tap, single tap, single tap. Uh, that's not working. Double tap, nothing's there. And short, long, but single tap should be working. Single tap, no. Okay, so that's not working for me either. Uh, let me go ahead and use my finger. Single tap, boop, 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 boop. Uh, okay. Um, what did I just do? I just did short long, a short tap followed by a long tap. Okay, maybe I did it right that time. Double, single tap, single tap. Yeah, so single, okay, so single tap and the short one, that's actually turn. oh, so I'm so stupid, nothing was selected. Uh huh, that's hilarious. So screen off. So you guys probably like, this guy's an idiot, but I'm not. So single tap and there it turns off. There we go okay guys so that's it that's pretty cool um of course i don't use the status bar uh, i turn off hover it's not really working and um yeah i am using those things i'm gonna turn off upper left because i wasn't really using it and of course you can put colors on it if you want to but me of course i have no colors yeah full screen uh action panel these are advanced thing action panel um basically you can again set the left right up down corners for the action panel and the action panel is a little box that comes up quite like go launchers um uh don't remember what it's called for go launcher or or touch something like that i think it's called touch um for go launcher and those things are created by them uh don't quote me basically it's a little box that comes up in the center and you can go back home recents screen capture screen off that sort of thing but it's just a little box in the middle right there um and yeah just a little bit more stuff edge preference uh, you get the corner size, the edge thickness, the height, uh, vertical offset, horizontal offset, and the swipe distance. So basically it's just, you know, how far these things can swipe and all of that sort of stuff. Um, so yeah, um, very cool app, very cool app. Um, again, I don't like, I don't like using, you know, docs and stuff like that. I, I always customize, make my own themes, that sort of stuff. So, you know, it works very, very cool for me. I'm going to go ahead and hide those colors again. That's how I use it. And again, it's just a simple swipe from the left to go back and yeah. So I like mine to just be clear like that. As I see, I make themes. Um, this is a new theme I'm working on right here. It's called I Own the City. Um, very cool. So guys, that was just a quick look at all-in-one gestures. Hope you guys enjoy. If you do, leave a like, hit that thumbs up. We really appreciate it. Again, thanks to all our viewers and supporters. Check out that video, the 100 plus subscriber video. The link again is in the description. Anyway, guys, your boy Paul Picasso here. It's Tech Time Stay Tech. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.